Yo, I'm your host Anami, and this is like three. That's my intro. I'm still my intro. <laughs> Yo, I'm your host Suisai, and welcome to Lai Three, the Lightning Dragon and the Gold Thief. We're finally on it. Yeah. This is the last installment of the series. If he looks really grown up in the picture, oh my god, they yeah. grow up so fast. <laughs> you ready for this? I'm ready. As always, we're joined by Ainami, hi, me, hi. which tries to steal my intro. <laughs> my intro now. Kimi Kimi. Oh, that looks like Kaido Kid. Ooh. Once upon a time, there was a gallant thief. The thief traveled the world stealing one dazzling treasure after another. The thief's targets were always people who did evil things to amass more wealth. They always stole the treasure they sought without fail, and never did the police catch them in the act. The thief would sell the treasure and distribute the money to the poor. In addition, enough. I don't know what that was. I assume oh. it you. Oh. Oh. Oh, I think I know what this is. Is this the uh, the memories of me being child? I think so. Oh god, now I need to child my uh, teal voice. <clears throat> <laughs> Shut up already. I'm tired of the stupid story. Oh, I need to voice all of these? Who this? I think so. But doesn't it sound great? He could have all the money for himself, but he gives it to others. I don't care. I'll bet some people just see him as a gullible fool who'll give the money for nothing. Can you take on the, this one at least? Or the other? Or do you want to take on the last? Up to you, I don't mind. That's pretty warped. Do you always have to be so contrary? You don't need to lose your temper, Theo. Can you really say that living in a place like this? Where we could die any day, always hearing gunshots, shouting, screaming. There's no point putting your hopes in some storybook. Uh, so what's it today? You know how things are going? Shouldn't be any big conflicts today, I think. I already forgot. I think... Oh no, that's you. I <laughs> think that was the one that I <laughs> I was like, I don't remember the voice that I gave to this one. And then I'm like, oh, wait a second. Shouldn't be any big conflicts today. Seems they took a pretty big beating yesterday, too. And time to secure some food. I'll be going out. Alone? Again? Didn't you get hurt yesterday, Jean? An innocent Cyril can't have fully healed either. But, brother, you... I'm fine. I'm no fanciful storybook thief, but I can do enough to protect you all. Because we all carry the name Leonhardt here. <laughs> Theo seems really tired. Because he keeps insisting on doing everything himself. But maybe us slacking off is part of the reason. Hey, this gun doesn't have any bullets left. Uh-huh. Whoa, it doesn't. No spares, right? Now what? He already left. Uh... Let's go. We're always depending on Theo for everything. But it's more dangerous than just getting food. And as you said you'd taken a major beating, didn't you? Don't tell me you're gonna take one from there. Well, it's where Theo always goes. And the guards are bozos. Hmm. Safety, failure, danger. Enos, what's that thing you're doing? Oh, I'm predicting the future. I'm a guy who can't look back at the past. Well, I do think it'll be easier to steal one than usual. But we are talking about the gang. If we get caught, it'll be seriously bad news. Theo always does it by himself. Hope a can manage. Let's try not to get separated. Yeah. Alright, let's get going. Right, left, right. You having that much fun back there? Yeah. Breeding is fun. Um, right, left, right. <laughs> hey, that was two rights in a row. 
You're not making a mess of it, are you? Ah. Uh, can I start over? We're almost there. Hurry up. I thought that was. She looks so cute. I know, right? She's grown. Yeah, they grow up so fast. I think this oh is literally the one that I like the most. <laughs> out of all the designs. I do really like this design. It's super cute. What's this town we're going to now? I got a call from Ro Rosa uh, Feathers. Said there was this rich people party, but she didn't want to go and asked me to. But parties are fun. Does she not like them? She mentioned some kind of treasure thing, so the focus must be on that. Still, we can have some tasty food for free. All we can eat, then beat it. Hmm. Um, so, Leo? There it is again. No Leo. Oh, Hal, Ricky, Claude. <laughs> <laughs> and you get mad whenever I call you Papa. Kinda want to stick to one. If you want a single name, I'll let you call me it when we're alone, not in a town. If you promise that, you can call me Theo. Isn't that your real name? Uh, Theo? Uh, Theo Pence? Can I? <laughs> <laughs> Theo Pence? Yeah, sure. Just keep that promise. Got it. And I'd never lie. I promise, Theo. Alright. Now we need to think of a name to use in the next town. What? So, still a different name after all? The other name is only for when it's just us two. Mix it up and the deal's off. Why do you always need to change your name, Theo? Let's say I told a lie. What will the person who I lied to think? Um, they'd feel bad. Right. My face, name, and all this other stuff will stick with them. And they'd hate it. Just seeing that face, just hearing that name, will make them feel bad. If those bad feelings get big enough, they could bring harm to yourself or others. That's why I change my appearance and name at each town. So they won't feel bad. How kind of me, huh? Um... Couldn't you just not be telling lies in the first place? Now listen here, you little shit. What? You're thinking that much about it already? Yeah, uh, it's such a pain. Effie, think of a good name for me. Huh? Oh! The one on that sign. Sydney. I, I like that one. Maybe a little hard for you. Let's go with Sid. That's who I am in the next town. Okay. Um, Sid. I am Sid now. <laughs> oh. Music. Ooh. That's very majestic. It is. And louder. Okay, so what do we know? Something, something, treasure party, master of the place is Wilbur. It smells really nice. Wonder if it started already. Let's check the Grand Hall. Okay, we're moving again. We look really fucking fancy. Not gonna lie. We do. This is actually. I'm like almost as tall as you now. Kind of. No, no, you're not even with your bow up. I'm like. You're like. Look, I'm like half a head shorter than you now. Yeah. When considering that your like... head is, listen, your head is literally as tall as your body. So half a head is a lot of distance. To I... cover. <laughs> oh, there's True. some upstairs. Oh, there's a lot oh. of upstairs. Oh God. Okay, let's start with the uh, inside here. There's lots of peoples. I heard there's free food here. It smells, smells good. good. <laughs> Expensive looking alcohol. <laughs> um, okay. Shit, can we steal all of this? Any of this? Munch munch. munch, munch. <laughs> They're munch munching. There's a ton of guards. Wait. I wonder how much the auric antique would sell for. Probably a lot. I wonder if the thief truly is going to show. I don't know. <laughs> Alright. 
Because <laughs> we're probably here for the thief. Yeah. I wonder if this is a good viewing spot. Wonder where they got that. I wonder that too. <laughs> I feel as if that man's most lively when he's boasting. Pretty expensive Pretty... stuff, isn't it? Oh, I don't know oh. who's who. We're just taking <laughs> turns, I think. Uh, yeah, I was just taking turns. <laughs> Delicious. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I believe that. Oh gosh, so many! I'm gonna talk to you oh, all of them. Oh god. Dots. dots. Many dots. dots oh dots, god. Dots. Dots. <laughs> dots. Dots. Is this like some kind of cult or something? I'm scared. <laughs> They're apparently guards. Uh, whom's this? Um. We don't know it. yet, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening. Oh, your face is unfamiliar to me. Ah, then you must be the one who Lady Rosalie invited. Indeed. It's an honor to meet you, Master Wilbur. Oh, I hope it's not gonna be a character. Oh, I will be wonderfully <laughs> pleased merely to hear that you enjoy the party. Incidentally, if you can spare the time, I'd like to make a small request. Yes, go ahead. There's a man helping me with the party. An inventor by the name of Ennis. What? Oh. The name. Oh. Oh my god, the name. He told me he wasn't feeling well and went out some time ago, but has yet to return. Would you go look for him if you called? Ennis. Yes. Never to me. Thank you dearly. <laughs> he creeps me out. Yeah, that man was really creepy. Let's never talk to him ever again. What are you looking at? Yeah. Wait. Oh my god, is that him? Yeah. It is, isn't it? Like, it's literally the... Yeah. Ugh. I just can't handle being with so many strangers. Me too. Uh. Uh. Are you Mr. Hennis? Uh, oh. I I'm sorry. Uh, you, you heard that. Huh. N nervous. Deep breaths, presence of mind, breathe. <gasps> um, uh, is there something on my face? Yes, a pair of beautiful eyes and a good smile. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, sorry. You just looked very pale. Are you okay? Uh, I'll be fine. I, I don't suppose Master Wilbur sent you? That crazy looking guy, yeah. He did. He was worried about how long you were gone. Oh, I'm so sorry. I, I didn't mean to trouble him. The Phantom Thief is coming too, so I hope nothing bad happens. A Phantom Thief? Yeah, he still showed us. <laughs> 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 yes, we, we received a, a warning. Hmm, I think... Uh, the story and Kaido Kid are probably based off of the same story. Yeah... Something like... Tonight at 10? I I'm going to steal the Auric Antique. <laughs> I hear you stuttering a lot. I mean, I'm trying to stutter for him because he's nervous. Oh, okay. Will this happen <laughs> to be the butterfly that Tiff in the news? Yes, that's right. I didn't think they really existed. I designed the security system for this mansion, so it's another thing to worry about. Uh... Are you okay, mister? Uh, <laughs> maybe. Well, I'll be getting back to Master Wilbur now. Okay, bye. <laughs> A Fanta Thief, huh? I is it almost ten? I wonder what they like. Nah. <sighs> Sid? Huh? Yeah, I'm fine. We should go too. You look sorta of pale. Just like when you ate that grass three days ago. <laughs> oh, remind me. <laughs> you just been eating That's... grass? <laughs> oh god, there's so many people. 
Oh my goodness. It just has to be. I mean, just a while ago. Good talk. Huh? Interesting. Are those all doors? <laughs> oh my I god! Think they are, aren't they? Also, Why is the stable what... so fucking big? Do you see what's on the table? Yeah, why is it so fucking big? Well, what's this? Also, yeah, that actually is a huge table. <laughs> and also the stuff on it is fucking humongous, bigger than us, <laughs> bigger than the doors. Chandelabra bigger than humans. Some silly glasses. <laughs> Try this on, Effie. Okay. <laughs> They're on. <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, can you keep them on forever? <laughs> Why are you looking away? Uh, um, they suit you, I'm glad. Really? <laughs> Done. Okay, you too, Sig. I'm fine, thanks. Why not? I cannot even try to bring myself to look as good as you in them. I don't want to shame myself, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. Oh my god. They could only ever suit you, Effie. Uh, I see. Alright. Um, so, can I take these? Yeah, sure. <laughs> we got funny I just got an achievement called Duck Soup. Can I put them <laughs> put on? Duck Soup? Duck Soup. Oh my god! Oh my god! Is there a weapon? And they're a very, very strong weapon. You can have them. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. I hope you don't mind we stole your glasses. Why did they even have those glasses on top of this huge table? I know, right? This way is off limits. You can't go up here. Okay, then. Ah, uh, don't go that way either. What about here? You're worrying me, guests. What about this one? Ah, uh, don't go that way either. <laughs> so, what if I say this one? You're worrying me, guests. <laughs> You're oh my worrying God. me, guests. Ah, uh, well don't done. go that way either. <laughs> <laughs> Why are things so massive in this place? <laughs> I, I don't know, get it. It's Chandelabra that are just like huge compared to us. They're like almost yeah, double the size of huge. us. Okay, he's back okay. here. They're about, I don't know, a little bit bigger. <laughs> ah, it's you! You're a great help for bringing him. I don't even remember if this was a voice, but... Now we must wait for the thief! I worked hard to obtain this treasure. I shall not hand it over so easily. Okay. <sighs> you have pant and pant. It's multiple, so it's pants. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you call oh a pair of God. pants. <laughs> God damn it. <sorry. laughs> oh, um, thanks for earlier. I really just did nothing other than call you, but okay. Quite a lot of guards, <laughs> huh? Yes, well, machines have their limits. It's much safer to have people on watch as well. So, you said the thief will show up at 10? Yes, that's right. I, I have the warning here. This is literally Kaido Kid, what the fuck? <laughs> the mark in the corner is the butterflies. Alright, are you sure this is real? It would be a sort of relief if it were all just a prank, wouldn't it? So, what's the fin to thief? As I already told you, he steals soda. <laughs> Haven't you heard about them in the newspapers and on TV? 
phantom thief strikes again. That sort of thing. They send a warning to their target at in advance, uh, then steal an item. And the warning always has a butterfly mark on it. That's why they're known as the Phantom Thief Butterfly. Any corrections? No, that's right. They say the thief wears a butterfly mask as well. That's kind of fancy. Just like the stylish thieves you see on TV and in stories, huh? It really is. Even the police are at a loss. But, maybe it's to be expected. Their primary line of work seems to be fighting. Perhaps they're simply unaccustomed to dealing with slippery phantom thief types. Ha! Huh, that's amazing! Sid, what if you are a phantom thief too? I prefer alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> a phantom thief is still just a petty Berkeley. A heinous criminal. I will never, <laughs> definitely <laughs> never stole anything. <coughs> <laughs> we never steal anything. Ha, huh. but Sid. Hey Effie, <laughs> you've got some bits of pastry on your mouth. How clumsy of you. Oof. Well, on the other hand, it seems the thief goes after corrupt politicians. But their acts are still those of a burglar. Dots. Dots? <laughs> <laughs> you just imagine like someone actually just saying dots in a random conversation and you're like, Dots? <laughs> dots? Where's your mic? <laughs> oh, that's right. We're also asking the help of the police force. Hmm? But they don't do guard jobs, do they? Well, yes. But recently, a new... We do now. Ah, there they are. Perhaps she could tell you. Well, you got her. Ah, she's cute! Oh, Dots. I really like her hairstyle. <laughs> yes. Sorry to keep you waiting. Iris Ashbury, Captain of the Police's Special Investigative... Investigative... Oh, goddammit. <laughs> she almost had it. Iris Ashbury, Captain of the Police's Special Investigative Division, at your service. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, didn't stumble over a single word. <laughs> Not at all. Not at all. Oh, okay, I'll, I'll keep that part in. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn it. That's so perfect. <laughs> I really fucking like the designs of all the characters in this. Oh yeah. They're really fucking imaginative. They've got some awesome designs. Yeah. Investigative division? Yes, incidents have been increasing in number and growing more diverse as of late, so... While the unit headed by Captain Neil will focus on doing battle with dangerous criminals, the new guest in in guest of I'm glad I didn't stumble on any words. <laughs> the new investigative unit will focus on investigative matters. So, Mr. Captain and Vice Captain aren't you here? That's right. But if a murder or something devastating happens, they certainly could be soon. But please don't joke. Th that's not funny at all. But that aside, I haven't seen any of the other members of your unit. Oh yes. Uh, well, humans can't fly, can they? You <laughs> should just leave them all behind! <laughs> yes, it's impossible without some kind of assistance. Thus, walking humans are slower than flying dragons, surely. Your point being? <laughs> they were going to be late, so I went ahead by myself. Dots. What? Uh, um... I mean, I suppose I also shouldn't have gotten the wrong directions in the first place, but... It's alright. 
I can catch a thief all by myself if I have to. Y yes I'm sure. Uh -huh. Why me? Well, you <laughs> sure look competent. <laughs> Miss Cyrus, right? Yes, I'm Iris Ashbury. I'm Mephina, and this is a, a Sid. You're a dragon too, right? What ability do you have? Ooh, piqued your interest? Be amazed. I am a dragon who can use her ability to know anything about what I see. Oh, she makes a perfect person for her job. Which she means... does indeed. I'll give you a demonstration. Hold on a moment. Well, the face. Like a cat's <laughs> carrying off prey. Hey, that's rude. Okay, uh, analysis complete. The lady there. Your name is Efina. 98 centimeters tall. And you are a dragon whose ability allows her to subsist on eating lies. She's not even a meter tall. She's so tiny. <laughs> wow, you got it all right. And the rude one beside her. Your name is Theobald Lionheart. 100 centimeters tall. Uh, huh? That's a completely different name and attitude from what you just told me. Uh, you can't even tell that. There's no Antupas in the force, is there? I'm kind of surprised too, considering what a kid you are. How do puny brat like you become captain of a unit? Don't you make fun of me? I've been alive a whole nine years. Oh, aren't you a grown-up? A whole nine years? That's under half of my age. Five, six, seven, eight. That's about nine of me. <laughs> so tiny. <laughs> Theobald, a con artist who travels to many towns changing his face and name every time. And three days ago, you ate Nemo grass. Oh, that's what it was. Grass? Just mistook it for some edible grass, it looks to me. But why? Why? You have money, yes? To be exact, six? Hey, quit it. Huh? So you do have money? Who told me I couldn't get crepes because you didn't? Damn it. Hey, Birdbrain, stop running your mouth about sensitive info. Birdbrain? Me? You really have no manners. Just like Vice Captain Brett said. Ugh, just go away, please. What's he saying about me? Right, um, he's a crook. Arrogant and a pedo. That <laughs> kind of thing. Oh my Yikes. god! Pedo? Not a fan of me, is he? I myself doubted such a horrible person could exist. But now I have seen him, and I have seen it's all true. Ugh, I can't stand it. Go away already. An analyzing <laughs> dragon. They're really common all kinds, don't they? Oh, it's almost then. Guess I'll ask about that Auric antique to pass the time. I wonder if Auric antiques taste good. <laughs> Probably <laughs> does. I don't think that's food. What? Is she really think that? <laughs> <laughs> Amazing first impression. I just got achievement. Ah, <laughs> oh, isn't that just great? Okay. Uh. <laughs> oh, is something the matter? No, I just wanted to uh get a good look at this or it can take. Oh, oh, uh -huh, is that right? Then allow me to tell you about it. Whoa, it's so gold and shiny. Ha ha ha, it is, isn't it? It was created quite some time ago, but it hardly feels like it's aged a day. Many legends are told here in Goldtown, with its countless centuries of history. 
Wonder how much money this could fetch. God damn it! <laughs> how many donuts could you buy? Probably a lot. At least five. <laughs> Probably more than you could possibly eat in a single day. I bet I could eat them. <laughs> All five of them? <laughs> yeah. I could probably make way more being a treasure hunter. Are you changing jobs? Just considering the idea. No, I didn't say I would. Better to do what I enjoy. And here comes the climax. Without further ado, allow me to... Ooh. Is that the bell? Ah, so it's 10 o'clock. But as of yet, nothing has. Lights, what's going on? What is on? this incantation? <laughs> huh? Why is everybody stumbling? Oh, right. It's pit plaque for humans. Now. Hey, I know that was you, Effie. That hit my butt. I know you're there. I just saw... Wait. I think this is just a random person, maybe? I just saw a figure. Is that them? If for people, it's pitch black, isn't it? Uh, yeah, that's true. Yeah! The, the treasure! Oh, oh, it's safe? So it is. Then, was it just a sudden light failure? I did do a thorough inspection of them, though. Is it the wiring? Hmm. Outage? Wiring? Inspection. <laughs> Sid? Effie, did you smell a lie? Yeah, but it might be because of all the people here. And since it's small, I can't get it to take form. Huh? And us, the man on the right, he muttered, outage, wiring, inspection. But he never speaks when he's looking back on the past. He only mutters like that when he's trying to predict what will happen, or what to do. Oh, yeah. Yeah. How do you know that? I used to know him. A little. That's all. No. But if a lie won't take form, does it mean he doesn't feel guilt about lying? Or maybe he simply changed as time has passed? Let's ask him. I just like how they're all dancing. Everyone kept dancing. Are you okay? You still don't look well. Uh, 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 sorry, but I, I found nothing wrong upon inspection, so why? Outage, wiring, inspection. What did you do after your inspection? Um, once I'd done a regular check of the security system, I, I came right here. And you stayed here? No. I, I felt dizzy with all the people, so I left for a bit to look out the window. As you should know. <sighs> Sid? That was the first time you and I met, wasn't it? Excuse me? Well, yes. Was it not? Are you sure? Uh... Do you hate me? Uh, uh, I should have no resentment toward anyone I just met. Yes? Um... That's a lie. Nephi? Yeah? Let's go punch this one. <laughs> no... <laughs> uh... I, I know it's, it is what it is, but the way it's written is <laughs> God damn it. It sounds like, I don't hate you. <laughs> <laughs> uh. God damn it. <laughs> I wonder how strong I am now. You the have a boss this time with sketchy stuff. Some sketchy um, stuff. Oh, my God, shame. why are you calling that bottle? I'm scared. Well, we'll figure it out. I hope it's not like Rufinephrine or something. Is it what? You don't know what Rufy is. What's that? He was getting called. He was getting called a pedo earlier, so I was just, you know, 
you, like the stuff that they put this the stuff that makes people pass out like chloroform yeah oh just worse i didn't know that it's like chloroform but even worse what um it just tastes a little different from usual i wonder why does it now? Interesting. We'll talk to you in a second. Where are you looking? <laughs> <laughs> Just looking off to the side. I don't want to look at you. <laughs> Go away, you Peter. Oh my god. I saw a figure and tried to catch them, but I was covered with some kind of cloth. Then I got suddenly pushed. But the number of people in the room is the same. And the treasures haven't been stolen either. What does it mean? It means that one of the people in the room is the thief. Mm-hmm. Are you familiar with dragons? Yes, of course. They look similar to humans and have abilities like some kind of magic. Right. This girl's a dragon whose ability can give lies form, so she can eat them. Essentially, we know you lie to us. Ugh. That's really something. I'd heard about it, but... It's much easier to grasp seeing it for yourself. But that's good. That it's roughly as I thought. If things were a little off, I would have had to make some further adjustments. <sighs> Who are you? You're not Ennis. Yep. Huh? That's what I figured. It's not really him. Yeah, no, it's the Phantom Thief taking his uh, appearance. Yeah. Pardon my rudeness. It's about time I introduced myself. Huh? He looks really cool. Oh, he does. I like that. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah? That's not Enos, but it is one of the people. You remember the red-haired one? Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's the red-haired kid. Oh... It looks like the same hair. Oh, that will make sense. Yeah. Okay. That's why he would know Enos and about him. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Nice to meet you, if this is our first meeting. I have no name to go by, but I'm often called the Butterfly. So you may call me that. It's you. Where's the real Mr. Enos? Oh, you need not worry. He is alive. Somewhere. But let's not drag this out. No one wants that, do they? Yes, let us end this at once. Oh, that sound. Yeah. Yeah! What's that sound? I'll see you later, brother. Huh. Oh my god, I was right, I was right, I was right! <laughs>